Looking at the stock end of an AR, this one's a typical adjustable push up on this gizmo. And there's a receiver extension here, basically a tube. And there's some slots in the bottom of the tube. There's a pin here. As you push down, if you push up here, the fulcrum pulls down on a pin here, pulling it out of the tube. So that allows it to fit into either four or six positions depending on the stock that you're using. So now there's some options there. This one's a Volter made in Tucson, Arizona. A little bit different shape, a little bit different style. It's got some storage on it. Allows you to keep some batteries or perhaps a cigar in this cheek rest. See how wide that one is compared to this one. That one's about as narrow as the tube. This one's about twice as wide with some cheek rests that are removable. Otherwise it's about the same size. It can adjust the same way. Another collapsible but a different style is this Magpul. Again it can go back and forth on the tube. It's got a little bit different locking mechanism. As you push down here you can see the pin is coming up and down here. Once you've got it in a position where you like it you can lock that back up. That's another style. And then there's some styles for if you're not interested in having a collapsible style. You can go with the more permanent. This one's another Magpul. Pretty expensive one, but you can tell there's quite a bit of adjustment with this knob to adjust your height, with this knob to adjust your length of pull. And that's a solid stock, so it doesn't adjust this way anymore, but you can adjust the back end. Real popular for long range shooters. Then you've got this one, which is made by Volter. And again, it's similar. It's not meant to adjust this way. It just goes on the tube and it's a permanently attached. And it gives the shooter lightweight, full length of draw and a place to, to hold back here if it's the way you prefer to shoot. So there's some different stock styles for the AR-15 platform.